Alrighty, alrighty. Week one, day three. Um, today's gonna be some overhead press, mainly some shoulders and arms training, but we're gonna prioritize the overhead press today. It's gonna be kind of like the past two uh, workouts where we gave a lot of focus to the deadlifts and then the bench press. So that's basically kind of like half of the workout, it's just that lift. Honestly, it takes about 20, 30 minutes just to get through either bench pressing, deadlift, squatting, or like overhead press. It's just a whole bunch of warm-up sets, getting all the all the muscles primed and ready to go, and then giving it uh, giving it my all on the top and final set. So I really don't know what we're gonna do for overhead press, like how much weight. It might just be like a 25 pound plate, honestly. My overhead press is significantly weaker compared to my bench press, which everybody's overhead press is a lot weaker than their bench press, but mine is very lacking behind, so. I can do 205 for four on flat barbell bench, but then barbell overhead press, I can only do 95 pounds for like six reps or something like that. But it's all good. We're just gonna have to progressively progress with it over time. Hopefully I can do a plate for one is gonna be the goal by the end of this uh, eight weeks, I believe. So yeah, like I was saying, shoulders and arms mainly training, overhead press first. Then we're gonna move into, I believe three isolation exercises, gonna be some lateral raises some tricep pushdowns probably and it's some type of bicep curl so I didn't really give my shoulders and arms that much attention I still hit them a little bit on the, the deadlift day and then the bench press day uh, the past two days of this week so yeah I'm really gonna focus on them today give them a lot of uh, work because I trained almost every muscle in my body you know just make sure everything's good strong and uh, healthy but yeah shoulders and arms today should be good and I will see y'all with the top set of overhead press. All right, so 25 pound plate here, nothing too heavy. We're just gonna try to go for six plus reps gonna be the goal. I was saying in the in the car whenever I was talking to y'all, them overhead press isn't very strong. Hopefully we get it stronger over time. So, but yeah, we're gonna we're gonna clean it up and then we're gonna see how many uh, see how many reps we can get. Hopefully it's at least five or six. So. So actually, it's going to be a change of plans, I believe, from like just a shoulder and arm workout. I think we're going to do like a kind of like a full upper body workout, do a lot of like calisthenic movements. So sorry if the if the mic's kind of kind of messing up, it might be hitting my my chain, but it's all good. But yeah, um, next we got some muscle ups. I haven't even done a warm up set here. I'm just going to go into it. I think last time we did muscle ups, I got like, I think I just got like two or three maybe. But yeah, I think I could definitely get more if I did it before the overhead press, but I ain't really worried about muscle up reps. So but yeah, let's see, um, see how many we can get. And then after this, we're probably gonna move on to either, we'll have to see, either pull-ups or dips. It's gonna be one of the two, so. That's not too bad. We got three, almost got four. I just couldn't get that left arm up there. But that's all good. Sorry if the lighting's bad in here. It's a little bit dark, but yeah, next we're gonna move on to pull-ups and dips, so. I apologize for the last clip. My mic actually died, so the audio's gonna be kind of rough for the rest of the video, which it's all good. I just gotta charge the mic. Um, whenever I get home tonight and then our audio should be good for the next video so yeah we're gonna finish off uh, like the calisthenics type of movements with some dips and now we're gonna do one more round of pull-ups and the dips and then we're gonna move on to something else so
All right, y'all. Last exercise of the full upper body workout. This has a little bit of legs in it too, but not too much. We're gonna do some. Uh, we're gonna do one set of 20 burpees. It's gonna be kind of rough, so yeah, we're just gonna have to give it our all right here, and then um, we're gonna see what this pump's looking like. So one set, all out. 20 reps of burpees. So let's start. You ready? Three, two, one, go. The workout is complete, y'all. Honestly, kind of like having the upper body workouts on a Thursday. The full upper body is just because I don't really, I'm not, besides the overhead press, I'm not really too focused on like hitting rep or weight goals on every, on every exercise. It's just kind of like a pump workout, you know what I'm saying? I usually try to do like a vertical push and a vertical pull and then a horizontal push and a horizontal pull. And then after that, I'll do like some isolation work and then I'll do just kind of whatever. So yeah, overhead press was good. Muscle ups are pretty good. I think I got three on the muscle ups. Next week, we'll try to get four for sure. And then after we did the muscle ups, we did pull ups and then we did dips. And then we finished off like the chest and back portion with some um, dumbbell rows. And then for isolation work, we did the dumbbell laterals, the rope push downs, and then the rope hammer curls. And we finished off the workout right here with some, uh, some good old classic burpees. That's probably my favorite form of cardio. You get your muscles pumped a little bit and you get out of breath too, so. But yeah, overhead press, we're gonna definitely try to go up in some more weight next week. We did 95, I think, for, I don't even remember. I might have to go back and see, but I'll keep it in my notes. I think it was eight, 95. I think it was 95 for eight, yeah. So hopefully we can go up to maybe 105, maybe even 110 next week for maybe six to eight reps. But yeah, y'all, pretty good workout, pretty good day. I'm gonna be trying to go um, live every, definitely every Friday and Saturday night probably at about 6, 7 p.m. Uh, Eastern Standard Time. And then Sunday, we'll just have to see. The main, main reason why I can't go live every night is because I work until like, I get home at like 8.30 and it's kind of rough, you know, because I can only stream for like 20 minutes max. And I want to stream for at least an hour, hour plus maybe. But yeah, let's check out this pump and then we are gonna, we're gonna go eat something and then rest and then recover for next week. So, just the back muscles. I think that's the only pose we're gonna do today. I might hit one of these. We're just gonna leave it at that, man. We're gonna, like I said, we're gonna get this shirt on, then we're gonna go eat something, rest and recover, and then tomorrow's gonna be a leg workout. So I guess I'm, I guess I'm ready for that. So we're gonna see how we can do on squats, and then same as this workout for next. Same for this workout. It's gonna be for the next workout. We're gonna do our big like compound lift and a couple accessories and then some isolation work so but yeah man i appreciate appreciate y'all for watching um we're gonna be hitting these weight goals for sure next week too this is um week one day three i will see y'all in the next one peace out and god bless